Today we have a special treat, a giant French fly chicken tender tatter platter. How do you say it? French fry, French fry chicken tender platter with sauce. Look at this. Sauce, peppers, no, not peppers, pickles, fried chicken, and supposedly there's French fries, but I don't see a single French fry. Uh, maybe it's just French fry chicken tenders. Oh no, there's French fries underneath. This is 303 in the cut. It's a famous food truck in Las Vegas that went viral after a famous TikToker who reviews food, food uh, Keith Lee reviewed it and gave it his first ever 10 out of 10. Now, this is not an item that he reviewed or ate. I'm working my way through their entire menu. It's actually a pretty short menu, probably like 12 items, a dozen items. And this is one of the last remaining things on there. Um, I'll be honest, I, I've been pretty, I guess, I've been stricter than Keith Lee with his review. I have been not, give, not been giving 10s, not even 9s to some of the items I've gotten. One of the things I do really like though is their prickly pear drink. It's kind of a mixture of like pear, juice, fruit, um, and then Sprite. And it just has a really nice fruity taste to it with a little kick of uh, soda. A little bit of carbonation. I really like it. Um, I won't get this often though, just because it is kind of expensive. About six bucks for just that little drink, that little mix. But anyhow, let's check this thing out. This is the, um, they have two other chicken, fried chicken platters, but this is the one they say they're like most known for. So they drizzle all the sauce on it. It looks like some type of chipotle mayo. But then this side, a different sauce. It's lighter in, in, in color. All right, let's just take a bite of this fried chicken first. It's a fried chicken tender. Okay, not bad. The chicken tender is really crispy. It's got a nice crunch, a nice breading to it. It's not like it's overcooked or anything or undercooked. It's really nice. Mmm. The fry has a, a lot of good seasoning. It's almost like Old Bay seasoning. It's really nice. Lots of flavor. The fries are nice standard crinkle cut fries. You know, you can get those anywhere. The pickles, the pickle, but adds a lot of this crunchy, bitter taste, which is a nice contrast. Let's try the chicken over here with the other sauce. Mm. The first sauce was more, I don't know if it was chipotle mayo, probably not, but tasted more like it. The second sauce is it's smoother with a bit of a kick, like almost like ranch. And their French fries are really crunchy and crispy with that sauce. How about I read this? 8.5, 8.5. I'm sure like there's even crazier fry platters here in Vegas. There's a place called Mr. Fries Man, who I've seen with even crazier fries platters. But this is pretty solid. Um, I give it a solid 8.5. It's it's a nice thing to eat. Maybe you, you can buy this for a group of friends when you're watching football or something. It's more of like a snack on type of deal than like a, a meal to me at least. It's it's not the it's not the right vibe to like just eat this straight on, at least not for me. Um pretty solid, nothing really wrong with it, but um I reserved the 10 out of 10s for like outstanding blow your socks off food. I would say this is up there, really solid, um, but not to that level. So I'll give you a solid high rating of 8.5.